Spring weather, Easter day, he has risen. And here she is coming with full speed. <laughs> so that's when something like this comes into play. It's the Pop Babies, kind of a portable design, electric burr coffee grinder mug. I just got this in the mail from Pop Babies and I'm supposed to be able to enjoy my fresh made coffee anywhere and anytime. Okay, so let's unbox this and take a look at exactly what I'm getting with this. Looks like there's some kind of a cup here to measure out with. There's also this nice cup. There is a brush here to clean with. Also a charging cable, looks like a USB micro USB cable and a user manual. So this is how the product looks. The charging time to charge this up is 180 minutes and it's got some weight to it. Let's see what it looks like when you unscrew the cap here. Okay, see it's got the charging cable here that you could hook up to right here. So I'm charging this up for the first time just using one of my USB dongles here and it's charging with the red light and then once it's finished it's gonna turn blue. Now one thing that this does require that isn't all available with the device is some hot water which I have a kettle here at home and I am going to fill this up, boil it and use it as my hot water source. While that kettle pot is boiling my water I want to say that this thing is still charging. It's not a blue light here but for the sake of time, I'm going to go and use this coffee grinder a little bit early. But when you first get yours out of the box, you want to let it charge for four hours so that it has a long battery life in the future. Alright, so the coffee that I'm going to be using is this one right here. It's made by the private selection company. It is the Roasted Hazelnut. Mmm, that smells delicious. So with this measuring spoon, I'm just going to measure out a single spoon here of the coffee beans. Okay, so this is the situation I'm looking at here. I've got the grinder, that's this section here, and I'm gonna put this coffee bean into there like that, and when the lid goes on, just like that to the right, and it locks into place. Okay, I push the button, and it is grinding. You can hear it going to work. Now one thing to keep in mind while this is all grinding up is not to open up the motor while it's turning. Okay, just let it go, let it do its thing. Alright, so I just heard it stop, so I'm going to open up this motor. Okay, it looks clean in the motor right there. Let me unscrew this part here and take a look at what it looks like down here. Okay, there's no fine particles in there, so it's good, okay? It smells really great, by the way. All of those coffee beans have been grinded up. It looks really neat. It looks really good here, okay? So now, there's these little wings on the side here, and you can extend the wings out like this over the canister, like so. Take your water and just pour it over here. Just getting the coffee beans and the hot water mixed up good. Making a nice fresh cup of coffee. Wow, that smells amazing. Also, if the coffee beans are too fine, you can make it coarser by turning this to the left. If you want it to be more fine, you can turn this to the right. So. Just keep that in mind. You can adjust how the coffee beans are by just turning this dial left or right. And then from here you could just use this part right here as your coffee lid. Alright, so let's try this coffee and see how it turned out. Oh, that tastes good. Mmm, I like how that turned out. Now, the bottom section of this 
you can use to hold coffee beans. So keep that in mind and drink coffee, feel good and energized and I hope you enjoyed my tutorial of how to use this coffee.